Hello peeps, Dragot here with another little redstone tutorial. So this time we are doing an automated mushroom farm that automatically harvests mushrooms. Why would you need mushrooms? Because every sorted base also has a brewing stand and you need the fermented spider eyes to corrupt portion effects. So, how does this thing work? Well, basically it's that layout and what you do when the signal comes is this water stream like washes everything that has grown here over and then it falls down here okay so far so good how to turn the a signal that occurs once in a while like from this cactus clock into a signal that makes this redstone or let's assume that's a grown mushroom from this block which is the farthest one here to the exit where it drops down yeah well actually like this there it comes and as you can see the cactus clock has harvested it so this works like we take this signal from a cactus take it which is pretty short as you can see here off it goes we lengthen the signal with the signal lengthener all i made Two tutorials about both of these put them in the description and they then trigger this mushroom farm which is like closed by default here and opens if the block with the torch on it gets a signal so yeah this is one layer you could stack up infinitely up layers but I won't advise doing that because mushrooms in such close proximity like they don't want to grow so you're better off like doing a system with two layers and one seeding mushroom and then put another system with two layers and one seeding mushroom like somewhere else like here for example and this is quite a distance so um, they don't affect each other anymore just saying if you really want high rates you better like go with few smaller separate systems well download in the description of course as usual also i'll link the other two tutorials so you can finally build the entire thing that's it thanks for watching see you next time bye guys